a romantic excursion to the Hermitage. The famous museum is the perfect spot for young residents of St. Petersburg, Russia's Venice of the East. Katya Malikova and Vlad Dekalov have booked a tour. They want to rediscover the museum's rich collection. More than 60,000 works are on display in over 350 halls. It's a journey across centuries of European art, from the Stone Age to the present day. Everything here is true. Everything is connected to the realm of high art, with things that withstand the test of time. In each hall you can feel a presence, the unique atmosphere of the Hermitage. The Winter Palace was built in the 18th century on the shores of the Neva in the heart of St. Petersburg. It was the Palace of the Tsars and Russia's window to Europe. The palace also houses part of the Amitage, one of Europe's most important art collections. Catherine the Great established the collection 250 years ago when she purchased the collection's first painting from a Berlin art merchant. Today, works from Leonardo da Vinci and El Greco can be found in its halls. Alongside the Italian and Spanish masters, there are also works from Rubens and Rembrandt. Yeah, it's fantastic. We've, I mean, I've been to the Louvre. I've been all, you know, to all these different places, and it's easily uh, comparable with it. Uh, it's a, yeah, it's, it's quite quite stunning. It's absolutely amazing. It's one of the most grand things I've ever seen. It's just everything is so detailed and it's fantastic. Fabulous. I mean, like the Da Vinci we've obviously just seen, and this Rembrandt is uh, stunning. It's still we're quite early on in our tour, but it's been a fabulous experience. Visitors to the Hermitage can also explore the masterpieces of modern art. The collection ranges from Picasso to Matisse, Kandinsky and Malevich. And the traditional tastes of the Hermitage are starting to change with the times. Three years ago, the museum opened a new house dedicated to pop art and postmodernism. Everyone here, me included, is proud of our network of exhibitions and partners. Not just the ones in Russia, the ones abroad too, like Amsterdam and Venice. And we're planning new ones. Our museum is active worldwide. For many visitors, the palaces that house the Hermitage are works of art in their own right. They're a testament to more than 300 years of history and the Tsar's attempt to bring their country in line with their European cousins. For many of the Hermitage's three million annual visitors, the history contained in these walls is just as big a draw as the art collection. I'm from this city and I've never seen all the halls and all the artworks here. Every visitor to the Hermitage should set a specific goal and focus on what they're most interested in. Whether you're a child or an adult, a man or a woman, there's something here for everyone and every interest. The Italian masters have enchanted Vlad and Katya, but they've barely scratched the surface. They're already planning a return visit.